That was from my favorite childhood TV show, Hardcastle and McCormick. So one day I decided to build the car they used for the Coyote. I bought an empty body shell in Denver, Colorado. I trailered it to my shop in Colorado Springs. Then I bought a 1970 Volkswagen Bug just for the chassis and title, stripped it down, and had a little bit of fun with my truck crushing the body. <laughs> This is the first version of the car. I only had $3,700 wrapped up into this toy. It was a head turner. I used it as my daily driver for three years. I took it to many car shows and really had a lot of fun. Then one day, a driver came across the freeway and hit me head on and the car was torn. But I could not let it go to school. I had to fix it. So I gave it a tilt hood flushed up all the body seams, gave it four-wheel disc brakes, front tube frame suspension was all redone. Then I took a blank hood, it's kind of boring, so I cut some vents into it, designed new headlights, and lined them up with some strings, and here's the final hood design. And then, believe it or not, I painted the entire car for $20. It was a fun little toy. It was only 40 inches tall, 78 inches wide, and 1,500 pounds. The suspension was lowered and preloaded. The coil springs held the car up, and the torsion bars were round backwards for a very stable ride. This thing cornered like it was on rails. I enjoyed it for seven years, and then one day I finally saw it. Enjoy the video. Be sure to hit the like and subscribe to keep up to date on my videos. Thank you for watching. 